watching Greater Brockton, Mark Lindy, your host, and today I have back with me a fan favorite, Titi from Fuller Craft. Hey, Titi, how are Hi, you? Hi, good. Good to good see to you. Good to see you. So, we're in March. Yes. And spring is here. Yes. We lucked out this winter. Yes. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. But you have an you have an event that's been going on, but if you don't get this soon, you're going to miss it. Exactly. Tell us about it. It's Toothpick World from Sliver to Skyline. Mm -hmm. And there are, are these monuments from around the world, including Fenway Park. Um, constructed entirely in toothpicks. Mm. So you should definitely come and see it. It's so spectacular and it ends on March 27th. Okay. So yeah, definitely. I did popsicle sticks, but I can't even oh, really? imagine toothpicks. <laughs> yes. Back in the day, I ate lots of popsicles. So. <laughs> hey. But toothpicks, little, <laughs> even, even smaller. It's that whole spirit of building mm -hmm. that, you know, gets yes. you. Yes, I know. wanted to be an architect and then I found out how oh. much math it would take. Oh. And that was yes. the end of that. I was not good in math. <laughs> But I was good in other things. Yes. Um, you also have over there a chess club. Yes. So March 20th is our quarterly chess club. You can come and play all ages, all levels. We do about three rounds of chess. And it's, it's a lot of fun. It starts up at um, 11.45, you come and register. And then we start three rounds at 1 p.m. And we have some pizza, too. So, yeah, okay. you can stop by. And I think you also yeah. told me about something to do with Fiber? Oh, yes. Uh, March 20th is also our Fiber Weekend. Mm -hmm. We have a Mary Merrill exhibition opening that weekend, and it's all about tapestries. Mm -hmm. So we have the Weavers Guild of Boston coming to actually do demos that whole day, do a talk. John Colony um, is going to do a talk at 3 p.m. Mm -hmm. But that entire day from, uh, I think it's 11 to 5, you should come and 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 learn about tapestries and how they're made and pretty fascinating stuff. So yeah. something for everybody. Toothpicks, chess, <laughs> fiber, tapestries, yeah. you name it, <laughs> you got it. Yes, yes, okay. yes. Um, we finished up a school vacation. There's mm -hmm. another school vacation coming up in April. Is there anything going on during school vacation? There is Sensation Day. Okay. During school, that Thursday during school vacation week, um, we're going to have a, a, a whole day full of family friendly activities, hands on activities. You should definitely come that Thursday of vacation week. Mm -hmm. And it's 10 to 4. 10 to 4. Okay. Yeah, completely free. So, and yes. What about music? You seem to be, especially uh -huh. since you've been there, there's been a lot of music at Fuller. There's a lot of music. I love music, so yes, there been mm -hmm. <laughs> we've increased our music programming. Um, the Brockton Symphony Orchestra is joining us again for a chamber music concert, and that's going to be on April 16th from 2 to 5 p.m. So we'll have a beautiful performance by the and by the members of the Brockton Symphony Orchestra, and we'll have a little intermission and then uh, more music and then a reception at the end, too, so you can actually talk to some of the classical musicians. So, so that's yeah. the weekend when school vacation week starts, right before Patriots Day. Yes. And I, I found yes. the date in the calendar for the Sensation Day, the 21st. The 21st, Thursday. thank you, yes. Okay, so we have that. So there's all sorts awesome. of April things to go on. Yes. But you told me something interesting. Mm -hmm. Is it Finding a Voice? Is that what it's called? Yes, okay. and, I'll, and I'm going to tell you the whole title. Finding a Voice, Affecting Social Change Through Creative Expression with Julie Burroughs, and she's going, who is the Chief of Arts and Culture in, in the city of Boston. She's going to come and lead a panel discussion about arts education and how um, different, different um, figures in social, uh, in, in education and social service fields actually use the arts to improve people's lives mm -hmm. and to broaden the horizons of, of different folks, some who are underprivileged, some who are, um, are students, you know, just very um, interesting conversation about the power of arts education. So, and Brockton yeah. has a lot of arts going on. As a matter of fact, there's a Yes. There's an Arts Week being talked about in, oh, in yes. May, but yes. it's turning more into Arts Month. Yes, yes, And I heard yes. someone last night, I overheard someone last uh -huh. night talking about how Fuller has to be part of it because you're already a part of it. Uh-huh. Well, yeah. Correct? Uh, I, we're not a part of it, but... Yeah. Um, but <laughs> yeah. Heard, someone's I've, calling I've, you. Someone's <laughs> calling you. That's what I heard yesterday. Okay. I was at that downtown strategy meeting yesterday, ah. and uh, I know that 
the, the schools yep. do a lot in the month of April. Uh, or, 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 actually, I think it's the month of May. I'm, I'm a little ahead of myself. So okay. It's, you, you get a lot of it's, things it's, going on. Yeah. In April, but <laughs> yeah. they want to include Fuller. Yeah, I think it is May. I think that it yeah, is May. May, yes. Because I, I, there's yes. other places that do Art Week. Yep. And when the conversation started out, the first meeting I went to yep. was Art Week. And then everybody said, well, we have an event this week. We have an event this week. Yeah. We have an event this week. So they yeah. wanted to tie it all together for, for one month. Yeah. So if you want to find out about all the stuff we already talked about, there is a place to go to yes. find out. Yes, fullercraft.org. Mm -hmm. That's our website. Or you can also call us at 508-588-6000 and you'll uh, reach our friendly um, staff at the desk and they can tell you all about these events as well. Okay, and, yes. and everything is on that website. The other yes. thing is if you, Thursday nights still? Well, our, yes. our kitchen has shifted. So okay. it's no longer Thursday nights. We're doing more programming on Friday and Saturday okay. nights. Yeah, and I'll tell you about some of that stuff coming up in, in May. Okay, but yeah. I do, my question is, is Thursday night still the free? Yes, night? it is. Okay, yes, there's free admission at. from 5 to 9 every Thursday night. So if you want to check it out before you buy, before yes. you become a member. Yes, yes. You can check it out for free and then you'll get... <laughs> You'll get inspired. Yes. Correct? I love your thinking, yes. Okay. <laughs> You'll be <go>. inspired. <laughs> okay, so anything we missed, anything anything else? So we, well, we'll, we'll talk about the we'll other events in another segment. Yes, we will. I mean, workshops, we have some beautiful workshops this fall. Definitely check out the website and see what's available. A lot of them, um, we have a new education coordinator. She's got some very creative planning, um, creative courses. So uh, drawing, painting, all kinds of things. So definitely come yeah. and check out the site. Keep doing what you're doing. Oh. Thanks for being on. Thank you for having me. Welcome to be here. <laughs> you are watching Greater Brockton. Mark Lindy, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the City of Champions.